Howdy there. Here we are sitting right now on in, the top uh, on the top of the Avalon Waterways Envision Christian. Yes. And we want to take you on our little journey. Uh, we're not going to take you on everything, but we want to take you on the journey of the cruise portion of it. Right. Yeah. And so we get to the ship. Yeah. Totally blown away. They came out, they grabbed our luggage, they yeah. took us right in, they got us checked into our cabin, they took our luggage straight to the cabin. Flawless. Seamless. Oh we didn't have to wait for anybody or anything. This is a lot smaller than a cruise cruise. Um, I really, I, if you don't like cruising, you need to try a river cruise because this is really nothing like a big cruise like Royal Caribbean or yeah. something. I yeah. mean, it's... Less than 150 people on the cruise plus the crew. There's only like 40 crew members on this boat. It, it, it's, yeah. it's very, very cool. Uh, highly recommend it. But hey, stay with us because the next video is going to be day number two. And if you want to stay in tune with this, you're going to want to subscribe to our channel. You're going to want to set your notifications because day two of the series of the Avalon Waterways Damn You Dream is coming next. Yeah, but we want to tell you about the rooms first. Well, there's, they have three different types of cabins on the ship. Okay. They have a regular stateroom. Regular stateroom, which, um, you know, all of them are very similar. Uh, the regular stateroom is on the lower level of the boat, and it has high up windows. So we really don't have a view. No, no view whatsoever. And that's the least expensive. But it's you do, small. but you do have a window to let some sunlight in. And the room is, the, the stateroom is smaller. I don't remember the square footage, yeah. but it's. Uh, it's nice. It's nice. It's nice. Um, then on the second floor, that's, and I don't know if these are the actual numbers of the floors, but um, the second floor um, is where we were. And those uh, are the... Those are the suites, the suites. Panorama Suites. And the Panorama Suites uh, are approximately 200 square foot. Right. They have a full glass wall window that opens up, uh, two thirds of the window opens up. It is really, really nice. And there are bars, you know, to keep you from falling out. And the way the room is, is, is uh, situated, situated you have your your bed that's facing those windows, yes. so you can actually lay there in bed and look at the landscape as you as you go down the river. Which is really cool. It is very very it cool. Is very the rooms cool. are nicely appointed. I mean, modern modern. Um, but uh, simple. Con conveniences. Really but simple. simple. Yeah, very very nice. I mean, you you feel very comfortable. Yeah. The minute we walked on the ship, we knew that um, we were going to be comfortable there. It was so clean. And everybody was so friendly. I mean, going to our stateroom, it was perfect, in perfect condition. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah. On the third level. Yeah. On the third level, you've got more panorama uh, suites, right. but you also have two royal, royal suites. suites, and the royal suites are 100 square feet larger than the panorama suites. Right. There's like a little living area in there, and there's two televisions in that room. Uh, there's a larger bathroom. Yeah. Well, uh, well you've got a water closet. You've got a water yeah. closet, which is your half, separate from the double the vanity bathroom. sink, yeah. double sink vanity and a larger shower right right, uh, right it is and there's a, a seat in the shower yeah also. so so i'm going to tell you you can't go wrong with the you can't go wrong period yeah but you definitely want to look at the panoramas and if you can afford it you definitely want to splurge for that royal suite yeah, because the royal suite. they are very nice and like he said there's only two of those on this ship yeah and yeah. i highly 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 recommend panorama at the at the at the least yeah um we you know took a tour of the boat really quickly after we got on and uh, found the Panorama uh, Lounge, uh, which was, it's a place that's super comfortable. It's got lots of chairs and Just tables. Just a little bit forward of midship. Yeah. And it's got uh, a bar and then, it, then it's got a deck outside where you can sit. Right, and on, watch. The, right on the bow. Right, right. And it's, it's really a nice place to sit. We, there, are, there are a lot of people out there. Right. And then if you go, if you go aft towards the back of the ship, then you have the uh, the lounge in the back. The, what do they call it? The I think it's just the lounge no, because the other one is called the panorama, panorama lounge. lounge. And then you got the the aft lounge. Whatever yeah. we're gonna call it the aft lounge. Yeah. Uh, so they have a lounge back there where they have snacks and cookies and, and, they have books and, tea and games and, 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 and that yeah. kind of thing. And then they have an outside area if you are a smoker Smarter. and need to partake in a in a cigarette, pop your cigar. And that's yeah. where you're gonna go. Yeah. Um, and then if you go up. Under the sky, under the, under the top of the ship, you got the sky deck. Which is where we are Which right is where now. we are now. Yeah. And they actually have a jogging track around the sky deck. Right. They have a jacuzzi up here. They have these little sun areas like where we're sitting. They have checkers and backgammon, barge, and, uh, you know, there's a little cutting green up here. Um, it's really a nice area, and it's shaded. They have a tarp like things. These little sitting areas like this, it's yeah. got oh, four sets of tables and chairs yeah. uh, underneath each one, and then in between each sun deck, sunshade area. They have a uh, lounge, uh, what do you call lounge chairs, lounge lounge chairs. chairs where, where you can you lay back in sun and uh, sun if you wish. Yeah. So th this boat is pretty simple. 
but it's very elegant, it's very nice, and it's just the perfect amount of people. We have had such a great time meeting so many people, and everybody's just so friendly in the staff as well. Avalon Waterways. We give it a big thumbs up. You rock. We really love this boat. Now, say again, subscribe, set your notifications, and be with us for day number two. Yes. Thank you.